The class of 2020 at ISG Jubail was already destined to stand out by being our first cohort of IB students to graduate. Now the class of 2020 will be immortalized around the world. I would like to give you a quote from Leo Tolstoy's War and Peace, which has proven true in my life and which is very appropriate for the situation in which the class of 2020 finds itself today. Tolstoy said, we think that when we are driven out of the usual path, all is over for us. But it is just here that the new and the good begins. You are certainly out of the usual path, class of 2020. My hope is that this is where you will find the new and the good. Your shared learning, school events, study hall pop-ins, assemblies, sports, and yes, even the occasional disciplinary issue. I've had a very enriching experience with you all. And I've gotten to see you succeed, fail, laugh, cry, grow, and learn in an effort to become the person you are today. I've got news for you. It only gets better. My advice to you is this. Learn from the past. Embrace the present. And shape your own future. Class of 2020, I will not wish you good luck. You have ability, drive, perseverance, creativity, and many more attributes that will serve you well going forward. So forward may you go. Congratulations, class of 2020. I miss you. That's the biggest thought in my head right now. Um, I miss you and I'm thankful to you. Uh, it's been great. I feel like I should be graduating with you. Uh, everything I've done at this school has been done with you or through you or at the same time as you. Um, so I'm not quite sure how it will be when you're when you're gone and we go back to whatever the school situation looks like. Anyway, um, you're pioneers. You did things without having a model to follow. You didn't have an older group of students to, to show you the way. Um, and if you remember everything from the fishing game, then life will be easy. See ya. Greetings, class of 2020. I've been asked to impart some wisdom I'll give up my advice that I received from an old, old sage when I graduated eons ago. Don't pet a flaming dog. But on a serious note, congratulations on this momentous occasion in momentous times. I do hope life returns to normal soon and you're able to enjoy college and your first job, travel, marriage. Uh, personal story, my parents bought me luggage when I graduated from high school. A big case and a small case, which I probably told you in class at some point, if you had me. Um, hey, I saw the world and I'm still seeing the world, so not, not, that wasn't a bad present. Um, but again, uh, when I think of you in the future, I really hope I have a, most of my Facebook friends are former students and I'm amazed. I'm an old guy now and I see a lot of families being started and jobs and successes and uh, I hope I well, I expect to see the same from you. So best of luck and hang in there, we'll get through this. Congratulations, bye. Hello seniors, congratulations, and I hope that you are excited and looking forward to the next stage in your life. I'd never miss an opportunity to share a piece of simple uh, life advice. And so Mr. McLean reached out to us asking for that and, uh, and I wouldn't let that go by. So my advice, keep your notes from math class. Not only the math notes, but especially the one about success and making success um, your definition of success anyway, the peace of mind that's a self-satisfaction and knowing you did the very best of what you're capable of doing. Uh, hold on to that and don't measure yourself against anybody else. It's all about being better than your best self and continuing to try to do that every day, um, no matter what the situation is, whether that's applied to university and your classes and your studies, or being a good friend or making new friends or um, just being a part of your community whatever community you find yourself in so hang on to that definition and uh, just continue to try to be your best and you will have that peace of mind uh, and you'll be able to look back on what you've done uh, with a sense of accomplishment um, of giving it truly your very best it's not easy but that's the goal to work toward okay uh, enjoy this time, even though it is uncertain. Uh, make the most of it and have a good time. Um, and then uh, if you have any questions, of course, you could always email me. Thank you. 
Class of 2020, this is the year that you graduate. Very strange. Must be unusual for you. In fact, it's unusual for all of us. I just wanted to send my congratulations to you and hope that you're all well and to tell you to stay safe. Remember, you must take every opportunity as it presents itself. Even if things don't work out, don't look on it as a failure. Just let it make you stronger and continue. Best wishes to all of you. Stay safe. Hi, I'm gonna actually have to go off notes because you know me, I continue talking forever. So uh, I'll try to keep it short. Okay, class, get a skip rope and give me 500 skips. 100 regulars, 100 backwards, 100 crossovers, 100 doubles, and 100 of your choice. Uh, and then um, a quick 100 squats without stop. Uh, kidding aside, I want to congratulate all of you on your graduation for 2020. 2020 is not turning out to be a year that any of us expected. In many ways, you are and will be better set up for the world that awaits you than anyone else can imagine. You follow in the great tradition of former Jubail students who will create a better world for everyone by your further education in universities around the world. And lastly, challenge yourself both physically and mentally as you further your education and give thanks to your parents for everything they've done for you. Thank you. Hello class of 2020. Here's a message you'll never forget no matter how hard you try. Remember this advice. It pays to be nice no matter what you do. My simple little rule applies as time goes by. And when you're filled with doubt, I hope you'll figure out they're just possibilities. No matter what the future brings as time goes by. Here's looking at you kids. We'll always have to bail. Hi seniors. As a mom of a senior and a teacher, I've seen all year your willingness to do whatever it took to make this year the best year possible. And especially during this crisis time, there has been the we can do it attitude. The constant dings on Aiden's phone at all hours of the day and the night attest to this group's willingness to go the extra mile to support each other. That can do attitude will carry you forward through this crisis and beyond. Please know that your family and friends and classmates and teachers are only a phone call away, a FaceTime, or even steps away to continue supporting you. Sending you happy thoughts, well wishes, and a virtual hug for the class of 2020. Hello, class of 2020. Looked at a lot of the names on this list and it brought back some great memories. We're very proud of you all, and we hope you have the great memory of looking back at your education at at ISG Jubail, and that you feel something that really helped you succeed as you go forward. Again, congrats, best of luck. Congratulations, ISG Jubail, class of 2020. Remember me, I'm Miss Bennett. I used to post those positive things in the hallway as you walked by every day, and I was always the one that said, good morning, good morning, good morning, and waited for your response. Well, the time has come that you are now graduates and you are going out into the, the world, I just wanted to say congratulations. You will definitely leave ISG to bail stronger than ever, both mentally and, and emotionally. You will definitely understand the importance of having a safe surrounding, social distancing, and kindness to humankind. My words for you as you go on into your ventures, no matter where in the world that you go, always, always, be kind, be responsible, uh, be impeccable, and don't take things personally. Try not to make assumptions, and always, always do your best. 
Congratulations. Go get them. Celebrate. Yay. Miss you guys. Bye. Hello, seniors. Well, I'm sure you're all well aware by now that you're going to be the first graduating class in the history of ISTG Bale to be graduating virtually. Quite the honor. But honestly, um, it's going to be a real shame to not be able to give you a, a proper sending off in, in person this year. But um, I'd just like to say that it's been a, a real pleasure getting to know each and every one of you. I've um, coached some of you. I've had some of you in my, in my homerooms over the years. And I've worked with all of you um, with Cass. And I just really want to just congratulate you on your well-deserved success and wish you all the best in, in your next adventure. So take care. Hi seniors, uh, today I was asked to share some advice with you, uh, also a favorite memory with you. Um, my favorite memory with your guys' class would be last year we did a lesson on time management where you had to complete a bunch of tasks in a certain amount of time and you guys were singing songs and doing conga lines all through the classroom and laughing together and having a lot of fun. So that's my favorite memory as a group um, of you guys. And um, otherwise, I just, I've really enjoyed, I have a lot of memories of working individually with you guys uh, and um, getting to see you guys, your heart for others and you help others and stand up for others um, in many different situations. And I've, it's been a real pleasure to see um, you all individually grow to be people with integrity. I remember in in eighth grade, us having certain conversations that, that really led to that growth and for some, even just this year. Um, so I think that's really cool and I hope you will always um, remember who, what it means to be someone with integrity. So thank you for that. And as far as advice goes, I would just say never be afraid to ask for help. Um, I think that lots of times when students leave high school and they start being on their own and having to make a lot of adult decisions, um, sometimes it feels like you can get stuck or it feels like, well, I should know the way to do this. I should know the answer, but um, never be afraid to ask for help. Even as an adult, you, you, you have people around you for a reason um, and you need to, to be able to, to go seek help whenever you need it, um, whenever you feel like something's not right or there's got to be an easier way because chances are there are and you can do it with help. Um, and you always have your Jubail community uh, to fall back on when you feel like there's nobody to go to. Um, we're always here. We're always an email away, a virtual call away, um, even when you leave high school. So uh, please keep in touch and um, I hope you enjoy this day and this time that you have together. Hi, ISG class of 2020. Congratulations on a very important achievement in your life. Although I didn't have an opportunity to work with many of you in the classes. I was able to get to know a lot of you through NHS and after school activities. And I was always impressed with the amount of team building and leadership that I saw through many of your class members. Wishing you all the best. Hello there. Resilience. Resilience means the capacity to recover quickly from difficulties. Class of 2020, your graduation today is an evidence of your resilience. We are so proud of you. So class, stay tough, stay resilient. Keep going no matter what. Remember, tough times don't last. Tough people do. So good luck. Congratulations. Congratulations, class of 2020. It's truly a remarkable year. And you've reached the first step of finally getting out into the real world. As I work on student comments for the end of this year, I can't help but think of some of the things that help all of our students be successful, namely our learning behaviors. So the best advice I have for you is be organized, develop a schedule for success, complete all tasks for all your classes on time and do your best. Engagement, be a good listener, and don't be afraid to ask questions or seek help when you need it. Collaboration. Be proactive and productive. Work with individuals who are of like mind and want to be as successful as you are. You are the pride of our school and you represent all the work that we have and can possibly accomplish. So good luck. Work hard. 
Greetings all from Mr. and Mrs. Tim. Congratulations, class of 2020, and welcome to Team Jabalian. Life in Jabal has given you unique opportunities, experiences, and perspectives, and the skills to meet the challenges and the opportunities coming your way. We wish you all the very best and your families. See you on Facebook and hoping very soon that we will have a face-to-face -face so I can give you a graduation hug. Hello, ISG graduates of 2020, all the way from Jeju, South Korea. Um, I miss all of you uh, dearly. You're all fantastic students. Um, I've known some of you since kindergarten. So it's amazing to me that you are heading off into the big wide world. Um, my one word of advice is to uh, be pragmatic, but follow your passions and throw yourself into your passions, um, whether it be writing or art or sport. Uh, find something that you love to do and put everything into it. Congratulations. You are missed, and I think of you often. ISG family, greetings. Good to be in your presence. Congratulations, graduating class, on this accomplishment. I implore you to continue to study and never quit. I suggest that you internalize moral code to guide you through life, and I remind you that life is not a destination, it's a journey. Have a wonderful graduation. I look forward to your continued success in the future. Hi, lovely class of 2020. I am here from Toronto thinking of you and your graduation. This day is the beginning of a new phase in your life. So don't be sad because you are sitting at home. Start it with a smile and follow your dreams. Congratulations et félicitations. Hey Jubel, uh, class of 2020. Uh, I just wanted to say, first of all, say congrats on, on your graduation. Um, you know, I started the journey with you guys uh, when you were sixth graders. Um, I taught you in health that year. I taught you in PE and I had many of you on sports teams. Um, I mean, I, I, I remember a little loose lot uh, when you were playing volleyball and you would cry when the ball would come over the net at you to uh, become a very crucial member of our volleyball team. Um, you know, you've all grown a lot and, uh, you know, I know it's a tough time. For you guys and I know you want to be together but I think this experience is going to make you much stronger in the end and you're going to be one of the more memorable classes because of it. Uh, I wish you guys the best. Um, you'll do great things and uh, and best wishes to you guys. Congratulations. many many people here that I've worked with talked with you volunteered for me you have been in the plays you have led in leadership projects you've traveled on week without walls it's been an honor to know you and to um, you know to to serve you truly so may you walk away in life knowing that ISG was your family away from your countries it was part of your chemistry, your makeup, your fa the fabric of society. And the truth of the matter is I believe that we are all part of a common humanity um, on this planet. So somehow I hope that uh, you know that you've, um, you know, you've made a difference here and you're going to go on in life and make a difference somewhere else. So um, I wish you well. And this was our super messy message. <laughs> so, you know, um, I'm going to leave it to the teachers to edit it as they'd like. Okay. Um, have a great time, guys. 
enjoy whatever is coming and always know that you can reach back and you know keep in touch with uh, your teachers we always love to hear your progress okay take care have a happy grad congratulations graduating seniors welcome to the wonderful world of adulthood my fondest memory of all of you is actually as a collective your poise and maturity and setting a good example for the younger students around our campus thank you for that Advice I would have for you in your future is twofold. One, uh, honor that inner voice you have, your conscience, your instinct. You're going to be living in your skin for hopefully a really long time, so be comfortable with who you are as a person and the kind of person you want to be, and then be it. And then two, you're learning it, you know it. Be flexible and adaptable. Control the things you can control. Attitude and effort get you a long way in this world. Be positive and give it your best shot. Peace. Dear promotion of 2020, I'm in Alicante, Spain. Look what a beautiful place here. And well, you know, I stopped teaching, but I remember very well many of you. And I will remember you because you were my last uh, promotion of a student. So um, with this, I want to take advantage to give you last tip. And it is that uh, go passionate uh, for whatever you have chosen but think that in the future, if you have second thoughts, you just have to listen your inner voice to think what's best for you, and you will be right, okay? So um, have fun, learn a lot, be thoughtful about everyone else, and best wishes for all of you. Ciao. Hi seniors, congratulations on graduating. A bit of advice for the next part of your life from a coach's point of view. Uh, this is what I call tactics for life. I'm sure I don't need to say much more. If you follow this, you'll be grand. Let's go out there, give it our best, have fun. Hands in, Jaguars on three. One, two, three. Hola clase, well let me say that it has been two wonderful years being your teacher and I hope that you learn with me as much as I have learned with you being as your teacher. Now make sure that you keep on learning Spanish because I put a lot of effort into you and I don't want you to give up on Spanish yet. Now I know that there is some uncertainty right now but don't worry because nothing lasts forever and better times will come. You're still young and you have your whole life ahead of you. And one of the cool things about life is that sometimes the most unexpected things will happen and life will take you to, place, to places that you never imagined before. So all you have to do is be active and look for opportunities. Now opportunities, they will not knock at your door, but if you seek them out, you will find them. I really wish you the very best in your future and most important, don't look for a successful career. Look for something meaningful that will make you happy in life. All the best, adios. Dear graduates of ISG Jubel, class of 2019-20, What a lovely surprise when Miss Elena called me to ask me to be part of your graduation video. When I looked at the names on the list, I remembered many of you. How the time has flown. Most of you can call yourselves adults now and you will be entering a new world whereby you have to make your own decisions and come to your own conclusions. My message to you is to act with thoughtfulness and mindfulness. Mistakes will be made along the way that you will try to avoid these mistakes the next time. Each time you make a mistake, you stand up and you try again. Failure also helps you to succeed. We we'll learn from our mistakes. And one very important message I want to leave with you is, I would like you to remember time that has passed can never be recovered. Use your time purposefully and thoughtfully. I will never forget the two years with you in Saudi Arabia and the many songs that we have rehearsed and performed together. Can you remember this one? Yes, Poco Loco. Or oh, this one. Chicken. 
Oh, this one. Mercy, just to name a few. I hope that I was able to foster your love for music, if not as an active musician, at least as an active listener. I wish you all the best for your future. Listen to your inner voice and follow your dreams. The results you get from doing any task depends on the amount of energy and time you spend on it. And finally, maybe some of you will send me a surprise message sometime from some far distant country. I would be very, very happy to hear from you. I wish you all the best and much success. Your former music teacher, Mr. L. Bye bye. Congratulations, class of 2020. I can't believe you guys are graduating already. I have so many wonderful memories of our sixth grade science classes and our after school dodgeball sessions. Um, you guys are special, and I know you're going to achieve wonderful things. Um, well done. And uh, thank you, Elena, for um, helping to put this together. Um, I'm really proud of you guys. Congratulations.